Hi folks, hope you're okay today. It's good to be with you and we're here uh, to share the word of God. And we're looking at Romans. Romans uh, chapter 1 says, Paul, a servant of Jesus Christ, called to be an apostle, separated unto the gospel of God. Paul uh, was separated uh, unto a message. He was dedicated uh, to a message. You see people who want to do athlete, be an athlete, and they're dedicated uh, to being an athlete. They really work hard at being an athlete and they give their lives to being an athlete. Well, Paul was so dedicated to being a preacher of the gospel. Paul, a servant of Jesus Christ, called to be an apostle, separated unto the gospel of God. And he was separated unto preaching the gospel. That for him, preaching the gospel was so vital because he believed that the only way to get to heaven and the only way to know that we're saved, the only way was to know that we can be right with God through the Lord Jesus Christ. It says, which he had promised to fall by his prophets in the Holy Scriptures. The gospel is not a new thing. The gospel came in the Old Testament. The Old Testament pointed to Jesus Christ dying. In Psalm 22, it prophesied that the Messiah would die and that he would have uh, garments cast for his locks. On top of that, in Isaiah 53, it was prophesied that he would die for us. So the gospel is not a new thing. It came out of the Old Testament. It says concerning his son, Jesus Christ our Lord, which was made of the seed of David according to the flesh. That Jesus Christ had to come down the line of David because God promised David that there would be a Messiah. God uh, promised David there would be a Messiah and declared to be the Son of God with power according to the spirit of holiness by the resurrection of the dead. So he says and declared to be the Son of God with power according to the spirit of holiness by the resurrection of the dead. The way Christ rose from the dead When Christ rose from the dead, it was a demonstration that He is the Son of God. That God declared His Son to be His Son. That when Christ rose again, God was saying that this is my Son. This is my Son. And if you want to find salvation, if you want to find grace, then this is my son and when Christ rose from that dead, from the dead, God was saying that this is my son. It says by whom we have received grace and apostleship for obedience to the faith among all nations for his name. For Paul, he couldn't wait to preach around the world. For Paul, he, he couldn't wait to preach everywhere he wanted to offer the love of God he wanted to offer salvation he wanted to offer the grace of God that's what he wanted to do my friends because he believed that it would bring salvation it would bring hope in this dark world 